is to put the American people back to work. It is absurd that we got hedge fund managers on Wall Street who pay an effective, i.e. real tax rate, lower than many of you do. We are going to tell corporate America that yes, they will start paying their fair share. Now, all of you know, all of you know that the question of legalizing marijuana is not a federal issue, it is a state issue. At the federal level, I intend to take marijuana out of the federal system. But the decision to legalize marijuana is a state issue. Four states, Washington, D.C., have voted to legalize marijuana. That issue actually will be on the ballot here in California. That's right. I think weighing the pros and the cons, my own view is if I were a resident of California, I would vote to legalize marijuana. The most effective way, the most sensible way to address this crisis is to understand that substance abuse, whether it is drugs or alcohol, should be seen as a health issue, not a criminal issue. Some of you may know the Goldman Sachs, five or six weeks ago, they reached a settlement with the United States government for $5 billion. And they reached that settlement because they acknowledge that the subprime mortgage packages they were selling were worthless and they were ripping off the American people. I believe that today we should impose a tax on Wall Street speculation that will bring in more than enough money 
to provide free tuition and substantially lower student debt. Everybody here knows that the Native American community has been lied to, has been cheated from the first day, from before this country became a country. And yet our culture, who we are as a people, owes the Native American people a debt that can never fully be repaid. They have taught us so much. Among other things, they have taught us a profound, profound lesson that we must learn. And that is, as human beings, we are part of nature. We must live with nature. And then if we continue to destroy nature, we are destroying the human species. But you know what else we all need? Whether we're rich, whether we're poor, whether we're young, whether we're old, we need access to quality health care. And that is why we are going to pass a Medicare for all health care system. The political revolution.